I have tried skincare for years and years and years, and I've seen a lot of great results and some not some good ones. And I've narrowed it down to what I believe to be the best skincare of all time, items I keep repurchasing, I keep reusing, and that I actually see results from. So let's dive right in. The first one I have is not a surprise to you guys because I've mentioned it so many times. It is by La Roche-Posay, their hydrating gentle cleanser, you all. If you are looking for an affordable cleanser that you can get at most drugstores at Target, at Walmart, this is it. It's a big bottle, it's 400 ml, lasts you forever. I keep this in my shower at all times. It's a gentle cleanser that doesn't strip your skin, it leaves it hydrated, it isn't greasy, it cleanses your skin very well, but it doesn't strip it. It is my go-to cleanser. I use consistently every day and I bought many, many bottles of this and I'm used it over the years. Love that one for an affordable version. And then one that I've also bought several times now is the Peach and Lily Power Calm Hydrating Gel Cleanser, you all. This is a great cleanser if you want something a little bit deeper. So this is my go-to gentle cleanser. If I have a lot of makeup on or I feel a little bit oily in the day and I want to really cleanse it well, again, without stripping it, this is my go-to one. It's a gel cleanser. It really cleans the skin, leaves it hydrated, leaves it fresh, but squeaky clean. And it feels so smoothing on the skin and it smells amazing. And then my pre-cleanse options I have are a couple of them. I use this balm. Sorry, it's got water spots on it because it's been in my shower. I love this so much. The Elemis Pro Collagen one. They just launched this green fig cleanser, but they have other variations of it. They have a rose one. They have the regular one, the fig one so good and you guys can see i've made a huge dent in that i'm gonna buy another one here pretty soon it smells amazing it's such a creamy type consistency it's really nourishing for the skin it melts the makeup off it's just amazing pre-cleanse that i use before i cleanse it with my gentle cleanser and then the other one that i use as a pre-cleanser is an oil cleanser and i really love this one by bobby brown it's their soothing cleansing oil it's down to here so i'm gonna get another one of these pretty soon as well this is what i use to pre-cleanse my skin if i have full makeup on and I really have to melt a lot of makeup on. I have a lot of mascara, you know, gel liner, really heavy things on my face. This is what I use to just melt it off. And then again, I go back in with my gentle cleanser or my gel one as that final step to really get everything out of my pores, cleanse it out without stripping the skin. I'm a huge fan of double cleansing. Then the next category we have are face devices. Now this is somewhat newish to me. I only started using them in the last year or two. Holy crap, you guys, have they really gotten advanced in at-home devices? I've been really, really impressed with several of them that I've tried, but my absolute favorite one that I cannot stop using, I'm gonna buy several as Christmas presents this year because I'm that impressed with it, is this one by Blue Mean. I just started using this a couple months ago. I saw it all over TikTok and I was really intrigued because I was like, does this actually work? And then I saw people demonstrating them. And I was like, wow, that actually has some good results. So I got it at home. I tried it for the last two months. It works insanely good. Like I'm a 44, almost 44 year old. I'm a little fluffy. For me to have this kind of chiseled jawline and cheekbones you guys and I've not done any plastic surgery to that area promise it's just me using this device it has been incredible so I want to demo it for you guys so you can see I'm gonna do it on one side of my face and I've been doing it for several months so overall I feel like I'm getting a lot of contoured jawline my cheekbones and all of that I feel like my skin is much tighter so what you do is you just turn on the button and I switch it to the red light version there's different light therapies you can use but what this is is a microcurrent device that helps to tighten and tone the skin and it vibrates so it's really relaxing too. I feel like I give myself a spa treatment every time I use it. I keep this on my counter and I use this about three to four times per week. And I'm telling you the difference I've seen, especially my jawline has been in Incredible. So what it's supposed to do is help improve circulation, help your products penetrate a little bit better, and then of course with the tightening of the skin. So I'm just going to do this side so you guys can see. And I like to focus mainly on my lower face. And you can do your upper face too to help with the brows lifting and all that. And then I also come under here to help with my chin fluff. <laughs> we are gonna mount that chin fluff. We're gonna make it go away. <laughs> Try to massage it out. Okay, so let me do one more pass here so you guys can see the difference on each side. Okay, look at my face. We pull my hair back so you guys can see. Do you see the difference between this side and this side? This one looks more tight and defined, whereas a little bit in here, it's just a little bit loose and it's not quite as tight and firmed. 
I don't know if you guys can see that difference. It's incredible. Over time, you see more results as it goes on. And since I've been using this for two months, I really have seen a difference on myself just in how chiseled everything looks. So I have to say, I was skeptical at first with this device, but it actually really works. I'm so grateful. Thank you, Bloomine, for sponsoring today's video. This is absolutely incredible device. Love the results I've seen with that. So right now, if you guys are interested, you get $70 off for only 24 hours to the first 50 people. So if you click on the link below, you're the first 50 people, you get $70 dollars off and if you guys buy it and you don't get results you get your money back which i thought was really cool because they really stand behind their product saying that if you don't see the results that you like you get your money back so i'm a fan i saw it all over tiktok i was really skeptical and i was like i'll try this so i tried it for like i said between at least six weeks and i think almost eight weeks before i came to decision to partner with Boomy because i was like mm, does this really work and i tried it it was like holy crap this works amazingly well i love the results that i've seen really tightens and tones the skin. So I'll put all the information on the link in the description box. But thank you, Bloomy, for sponsoring today's video. I really do love the product. Next category, we have our toner. So I have three that I really love. This one is almost empty, but the Paula's Choice Most Moisture Boost cannot say that. I need more coffee. Moisture Boost Essential Hydrating Toner. Brands have such long names for their skincare products. Looks like this. You guys hear it? It's almost empty. I think I only have about two more days worth because I've used this so much. So I love this as my toner to hydrate the skin, nourish it, balance out the pH. When I have dry skin, this is my go-to one. But the other one that I love and I've talked about so many times over and over and over again, I have one upstairs and one here is the Peach and Lily Glass Skin Veil Mist. This is what I use when I also need hydration, but I have one in my makeup room upstairs. So when I do my makeup, if I feel like it looks a little powdery, a little cakey, I just mist this all over the face and it gets rid of the cakiness. It rehydrates the skin. It makes it look dewy, glowy, and fresh. Love this one. It'll always be in my set of skincare products. And then the third one I have, I ran out, but I'll put it here on the screen, is the Ordinary Glycolic Acid Toner. If you are not using an acid in your skincare routine, you need to start immediately. I'm telling you, it's life-changing. I did a video before. Stuff that I've done for my skin that has been life-changing, adding acids is critical. So either a lactic acid or a glycolic. If you want to use a glycolic, I love the Ordinary one because it's inexpensive. It's a big bottle. It lasts forever, and it's really effective at exfoliating my skin, getting rid of dry patches, redness, helps it calm down inflammation, helps with acne, so many amazing benefits of using acids in your skin, but it is potent, I'm gonna say. So start off lightly, use it just once a week. Don't use it more than two or three times a week because it is strong and it will burn if you have sensitive skin. So go lightly, like I said, put a really hydrating moisturizer on top, but the results, incredible. Next category, we have our serums, and this is your powerhouse product. If you are gonna spend any money in your skincare routine, I would say a good device, good serums, that's it. The other parts you could kind of skimp and save a little bit, but the serums, I don't play when it comes to serums. So first one I have is the Clarins Double Serum. You guys, I probably purchased at least 10 or 12 bottles at this point. I consistently return back to it. It is incredible. It hydrates my skin, it calms it down, it keeps the acne away. It's a miracle in a bottle. I don't know how to describe this other than this is my go-to when I need extra hydration, when my skin is feeling dull and light lifeless and I want to depuff it. Like it does so many amazing things. I cannot say enough great stuff about that Clarins Serum. It's literally, I've bought 10 bottles. It says enough right there. This is the other acid that I was talking about. So I switched all the glycolic acid for now and I'm doing the lactic acid by Sunday Riley, the good jeans one. I started using this earlier this year. This is my third bottle that I've purchased. Incredible. So lactic acid is a little bit more gentle than glycolic because I'm on tretinoin. Between the glycolic and the tretinoin, it was a little too harsh on my skin. So I switched to this one because lactic acid is more gentle. So if you have not started acids at all and you really need to start, I would say try lactic acid first. It's more gentle. It cleans out the pores. It helps with acne. It helps with pigmentation, fine lines. So many amazing benefits to that. So I really love that lactic acid serum. And then vitamin C. Get a good quality vitamin C, you guys. It helps with pigmentation. It brings antioxidants to the skin. It helps with fine lines, pores, like so many amazing things as well. But the skin suit Cool CE Ferulic. I've talked about this so many times. I probably purchased four or five bottles of this now. She's pricey, so I try to spread it out a little bit, but I use this in the morning. So I wash my face, put the vitamin C on, then I put my moisturizer on top. It helps with environmental stress and all of the things in the pollution and atmosphere that are going to kind of damage my skin. This helps protect it. It's incredible. Love that one. And then the other one by 
SkinCeuticals that I love is this Phytocorrective Gel. This, I've probably bought four or five of this as well. This is my emergency serum when my skin is red, it's dehydrated, it's inflamed, it's raw, it's whatever. If it's got redness and it's dry, this is my emergency serum that I put on to calm it down. It gets rid of redness, it hydrates it. When I wake up the next day, my skin is totally totally different texture than before I started using it. So this is pricey as well, but worth every penny in my opinion, because it literally is my, I don't know how to say it, it's my emergency serum when it's like my skin is dying and it's rough, having a rough day. This is what saves it. Next category, we have our moisturizers. This is another one that you could save money, but I like to spend a little bit more because it's sitting on my face all day long. So I have four favorites. First one I have is the Tatcha Indigo Overnight Repair. This is what I use at night on the nights that I'm using my tretinoin. When I have a really strong active that I know it's gonna irritate my skin and dry it out, this is what I use to calm it down. So if you have dry skin or sensitive irritated skin, this is incredible. It's very thick. If you have oily skin, it may be a little too thick, but for me, it works out absolutely incredible. Makes my skin the next morning smooth as a baby's butt. And then the other one that I use during the day when I don't want something quite as heavy is this one by Peach and Lily, the Matcha Pudding Antioxidant Cream. It's really lightweight. It's hydrating on the skin. I probably purchased three of these by now. This is my third one. And it's just, it's a great everyday moisturizer. It's not greasy, not heavy. It doesn't break me out. It's great for all skin types. So that's my go-to. And then another one that I use during the day when I don't need as much hydration as well is the La Roche per se the double repair face moisturizer i love this one because it's super affordable works great there's no fuss about it but it does have niacinamide in it which is incredible for the skin that helps me with pigmentation helps me with not breaking out as much it calms down my skin i'm a huge fan of niacinamide so this has it in there which i love and then the other moisturizer i have i ran out of i have to go buy some more is the elemis pro collagen marine cream i bought probably 15 bottles of that in the last 10 years you guys it's insanely good it's a very nourishing hydrating skin that I use at night as well so if you have dry skin you want something that's very luxurious hydrating great for combination to dry skin love that one next category are face masks and I have a few that I love the first one I have is by skin SkinCeuticals now these are pricey as well so I only use these on rare occasion when my skin is having a freak out moment if I get say a laser treatment done or I get sunburned or my skin is really dry and just broken out and is really struggling I use the biocellulose restorative mask Holy crap, did these work good. You guys, I had a really strong laser treatment years ago. It's been a while since I've had one done, but I had it done years ago and my face was on fire. So I went home and I put one of these in the fridge and I put it on, you guys, within a couple hours, my skin was completely calmed down, it was hydrated, it was smooth, it was not inflamed at all. I don't know what kind of magic is in these things, but they work so good. So I always have these on hand for emergency situations when I really, really need like a skin overhaul. And then the other one that I use when my my skin is broken out is this one by Marad. It's their Acne Control Rapid Relief Acne Sulfur Mask. So it has sulfur in there. It does not smell funky, you guys show you. No, it doesn't smell funky at all. Because when I first got it, I was like, is this going to smell like sulfur? It doesn't. But I use this when I'm broken out a little bit and I just need to kind of unclog my pores a bit. I love that one. And then the other option I have for when I'm breaking out or when I have just irritation on my skin or my pores feel really clogged and I have a lot of like makeup and junk stuck in there. I use the Porefessional Deep Retreat by Benefit. This one's high rated on Sephora. A lot of people really like this one. It's a clay mask and clay is really good for getting out impurities out of the skin. So I leave this on for 30 minutes. I take a bath. I do my ritual once a week, sit in there, have a spa moment for myself. And it works so good. And this one smells really good too. To me, it smells a little bit like blackberries in there. I don't know if there's any berries in there, but it smells really good. And it really cleans out my pores. I love that one. Do you guys like how I started with one dog and then it was two? And now Lexi's back there, like tearing up my pillows. Like she thinks this is her bed. Oh yeah, you cozy? Is that a good cozy bed? Thanks for messing up my pillows. Next category we have is eye creams. So first eye cream I have is by Peach and Lily, their Pure Peach Retinoic Eye Cream. I love this one for brightening and tightening my dark circles. I feel like when I have dark circles under here, this one helps a lot with that. It's very nourishing, it's hydrating, it doesn't irritate the skin. I love Peach and Lily as a brand in general. And then Murad makes some of my favorite eye creams. If there's one thing that Murad does really well, it's their eye creams. I love everything they put out in that category, but they have this targeted wrinkle corrector 
protector, which is great for wrinkles as well. But they have one that's a deep puffer one. I can't find it. I think my daughter took it. It looks like this, but it's the, I think the orange one, it's the deep puffer one. Insanely good. But I love this because it has that metal side here that's so cooling on the skin. So I just put a little bit here and I kind of massage it in. And I do like this ritual at night to deep puff my eyes and help with circulation here. So what I do is I put just a little here under the eyes and I take that massager, that kind of cooling metal side, and I rub it like this back and forth really gently to kind of improve the circulation here. And I notice when I do that in the morning, my dark circles aren't quite as prominent and it's less puffy under there. So I love those a lot. And then the last one I have that is for brightening is by Beauty Bio. I bought this at Nordstrom. It's the Eyelighter Concentrate. You guys, this is so good too. It has the metal wand as well. So you just pump it to get a little bit out like that. And I put it in. Let me show you guys what it does to my dark circles. It brightens it like instantly. Let me show you. Really, Lexi? You cozy? <laughs> so same thing. I just kind of massage it back and forth. But let me show you guys how it brightens it instantly. So I'm trying to be gentle because that skin is really thin under there. Do you see how much brighter it is? I know I have kind of bright lights in here because it's dark out right now, but do you see? It really does brighten the skin. So I love that. This is my first one I bought. I'm probably halfway through it, but I know when I run out, I'm going to buy that again too. Then the last category we have is sunscreen. So I just have two favorites that I really like. The first one is Elta MD. They have a few variations. This one's actually my husband's because it's tinted. It has a color to it. So I got this for him because he loves a good Gun sunscreen. This is 40 SPF. It's tinted. Works really well because he has deeper skin. So I want something that is tinted. However, they have another version that I ran out of. I'm so I need to go get some more, but it's the zinc oxide version. So for me personally, I can't wear octanoxate. I can only wear natural mineral sunscreen. They have a version that is mineral based. It's incredible. It does leave a little bit of a white cast, but I rub it in really well. I put makeup on top. You can't tell, but it works really, really good. And then the one I'm using right now the most too is by Kosas. They're dream beam comfy smooth sunscreen i like this one because it's a mineral spf it also has peptides in there so ceramides hyaluronic acid so it has some great skincare properties in addition to having a great sunscreen so that's my favorite that i'm loving right now then the last category i have is makeup remover and lash serum so the makeup remover i just have one there is no competition for this this is my go-to my ride or die i've used it for 20 years now it's an oldie but a goodie the clinique one the purple one the take the day off remover nothing compares. I have nothing to say about this other than it gets all of your makeup off, doesn't strip the skin, it doesn't leave it super greasy, it's hydrating, it's gentle, it works incredible. I have not found anything to replace this. I've literally purchased well over 20 bottles over the last 20 years. Still hits just as good now as it did 20 years ago. And then the lash serum that I use, I used to use, what was the name brand one that was like Latisse? It was like super expensive. I got tired of paying money for that. So now I use the Revita Lash one. I got this from Nordstrom. This this is a lash serum that's much cheaper than the prescription wine. You can get it at Nordstrom. It works really, really well. I actually found out about this from Tiffany D. Do you guys remember that old school OG beauty influencer Tiffany? She still does videos. She has great recommendations and she recommended this because her lashes are so long, so gorgeous. So I was like, well, dang, I want lashes like her. So I got it and actually works really, really good. So love that as my lash serum. And I put it in my brows too. So hopefully that gives you guys some great options for your skincare of amazing products that I love. I've purchased so many times over and over. If you guys are interested in getting that Blue Mean device and you wanna save some money just for right now, 24 hours, click on the link below. Thank you so much Blue Mean for sponsoring this video. I hope you guys have a great week. Stay happy and healthy like always. Me and the three doggies, Bella, Lady, Lexi, all say have a great week and I'll speak to you soon. Bye.